हेलो डियर ई ड्रॉर वेलकम टू वंडर शेयर ई ड्रॉ सॉफ्ट चैनल आई एम हमास अहमद अ प्रोफेशनल आर्किटेक्ट विद ओवर फाइव इयर्स ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस इन डिजाइनिंग इनोवेटिव एंड फंक्शनल स्पेसेस आई एम ऑल्सो अ प्रोफेशनल ऑथर इन ई ड्रॉ मैक्स टेम्पलेट कम्युनिटी आई हैव कॉन्ट्रीब्यूटेड सेवल फ्लोर प्लान टेम्पलेट्स दैट हैव हेल्प डिजाइनर्स स्टूडेंट्स एंड प्रोफेशनल क्रिएट ले आउट सफिशेंटली सम ऑफ माई मोस्ट पॉपुलर टेम्पलेट्स इंक्लूड थ्री स्टोरी हाउस लेक फ्रंट हाउस frame house plan and four bedroom house which have been widely appreciated for the ease of use and adaptability in architecture precision and efficiency are everything over the years i have experimented with several tools to streamline my workflow especially for creating floor plans most of them were either overly complex or came with hefty price tag that's when i came across edromex and it has since become an essential part of my design process for those just starting in architecture or any other professional field my advice is to focus on developing your skills and building a strong foundation of knowledge it's essential to understand that true success comes from your expertise dedication and hard work don't let money be your primary goal it's merely a byproduct of the value you bring into your work As you grow and refine your skill set, opportunities and financial reward will naturally follow you. Invest in learning, embrace challenges, and prioritize delivering quality results. Remember, a solid skill set and consistent effort are what truly sets you apart in the long run. A key part of my growth as an architect has been finding tools that align with my workflow. Etromex has been one of the most valuable assets in my toolkit. It helps me stay organized, plan projects efficiently, and communicates complex ideas in a visually appealing way. Whether it's brainstorming for a new design or presenting concepts to clients, Etromex makes a process seamless and effective. Architectural tools are often seen as an investment, and in many cases their prices are out of reach for students, freelancers, and small firms Etromex changes that narrative it offers professional grade capabilities at a fraction of cost of other platforms Etromex isn't just another design tool it's a comprehensive solution tailored for architects and designers it simplifies the creation of precise and professional floor plans offers customizable templates to accelerate the workflows and provides exceptional value for its price Most importantly it's empowers you to focus on what you do the best designing spaces that inspire if you are looking for a designing tool that combines ease of use flexibility and affordability edromex is the perfect choice explore it today and experience the difference it can make to your architectural projects so as this video is specifically about floor plans So we will simply click on floor plans and here we have the option of blank drawings. We click on it and this is the main interface where we will be creating our floor plan. Here we have font and alignment bar, tool bar, styles bar and here we have arrangement and replace bar. On the very left we have different tabs for addition and modifying the floor plan. On the very first we have templates. We have symbols, text images if you want to insert any icons stickers we have charts and widgets and if you want to set units of the drawings on the very top we have different tabs we will select design and at the very end we have units we will click on it and here you can see different options you can select whichever you want to work in for me i will choose feet and inches from here and If we talk about the page size, here you can see another tab. We will click on it, and here are different options for page sizes. So moving forward, if you want to select or use any pre-designed floor plan, you will have to simply click on templates here, and you can search any desired function or type of floor plan here. Here I am going to select this home plan. Just simply click on it, and it will open in your main interface. If you want to change any wall you can simply drag and drop like this and if you want to put it back simply control Z and it will undo it and if you don't like this bed for example you will simply click on it 
and press delete and here in symbols we have different options we will click on bedroom and here are different types of bed if you want single bed we will click here and it will appear on your clothing simply click and drag it right here and if you have any doubts in the layout like I don't like this right here it is very congested and small so I will simply select the table and delete it and for this I have to drag it here delete the wall and again in symbols we have to click on symbols we have wall shell and structure and we will simply drag a wall here put it here drag it down and simply drag the, select the door back and put it here we will delete this door as we don't need it anymore and now if you want to redesign this kitchen area again go in symbols we have walls and shelves just close it here you can see kitchen and dining room we have different fixtures over here what we need is a slab click and drag in the plan move it here click and drag again I want to rotate just click on it and rotate drag again so this kind of error you can simply right click here you, you see the options right here send to back here and this will put it forward and now if you want to add any plants in the outer area right here again go in symbols close this and we cannot find any plants right here so in this case go and manage more symbols and we have to find floor plan here click on floor plan and we can see a complete set of library of fixtures here scroll down find plants here here we can see the plants simply select it ok and here it will open in your main tab select any plant you like and drag it in the floor plan and if you don't like the size simply select scale it down and adjust it wherever you like it as you have seen we can simply open any template in eDramix and modify it according to our needs now that we have explored the option of templates let's start making a floor plan from scratch and see how eDramix makes the process simple and efficient here we have the main interface of eDramix on the very top we have this plus sign just click on it here we have multiple options click on floor plan here we have grid based workspace that helps us in precise alignment I'll start by setting up the scale and dimensions to ensure accuracy we have this design tab here just click on it and here we have units there are multiple units for me I am going to use this B10 inches now that we have adjusted our workspace let's start making a floor plan I am going to make single bed apartment and I will take you through the simple and efficient process of making a floor plan in eDrawing. To make one bed apartment, we are going to need a scale. Let's go to symbols. Here we have wall shell and structure. I am going to select this scale. Drag it here. And now if I want to change the thickness of wall, I will just click on wall. Here again wall. Here I have the thickness which is 7.8 inches right now. I will just select it, write the new thickness, apply to all walls and OK. Let's start by making the bedroom first. I am going to need a vertical wall and a horizontal wall. Here let's drag the horizontal wall first. And if I want to resize this, I will just simply double click, write 14 feet and click outside. I will adjust this into the clean. We even need a vertical wall. Click and drag. I need it as 12 feet. Simply double click, drag 12 feet, and click outside. I will adjust it here in the plan. And now this is 14 by 12 feet bedroom. Here we are going to make a living room, and you can see this space is not enough. We will simply click here, drag it on the left side, and increase it accordingly. I think this is enough and now we will add some more wall for a bathroom over here and a utility room over here click and drag and let's make it a little shorter 
here. Now, if I want to copy this wall, I will simply press Ctrl, drag, and here. This makes a copy of anything. Again, Ctrl, click on the wall, and drag. This will make the copy. So, I need a version over here. Click on the wall, simply drag, and this is going to be the version. Now that the wall structure is completed, we are going to add some doors and windows. Let's go here, close this, open doors and windows. Let's select one for the entrance first. I like this one, click and drag it here, place it here. And now let's select one for the other rooms. I like this one. As you can see, we have an option of rotation here. Click, rotate it on the right, click and place it on the plan. Now I want to place it on the bedroom. Control, click and drag for copies, rotate it down, click and drag, right here. For this kind of error, we just have to right click on the door, like this. Now we have two flips here, first click on horizontal flip, right click again, now vertical flip. It will place it exactly where you want. Moving forward, now we need the windows for the plan. Go here again, click on window, place it here, this one is going to be the kitchen. Control, click drag, rotate it on the right, click and drag it here. This one is going to be for living room. Click, control, drag, rotate it down. Let's place one for the bedroom right here. Now I need one for utility and bathroom. Control, click drag, control, click drag for two windows. I will make it a little shorter. Click and place it here. Now lastly for the bathroom, make it shorter like this. We can place it right here. Now you can see a complete structure including walls, windows and doors are completed. Now we need furniture for different rooms. Let's go in symbols again. Close this. Find bedroom. Click here. And I'd like this bed. Rotate it like this. Now we need fixtures for the bathroom. Let's go in symbols again. Close bedroom. Open bath. We need a sink. A toilet seat. And lastly, a shower. Click and drag it here. Rotate the seat. Place it right here. And lastly, we need to adjust the sink. Rotate it wherever you like it. And place it like this. Now let's move towards living room. Close bathroom. Open sofas. I like this one. Rotate it on the left. Place it here. Now moving towards kitchen. Close sofas, find kitchen and dining room. First we need a slab. Place it here, make it a little bigger, like this. Now we need a stove and sink. Here is the stove. Drag it down for sink. Right here, place the stove. We need to make the sink a little smaller, like this. And place it right here. Let's add a washing machine in utility. Close this. Find appliances, right here, now find a washing machine, drag it down, right here we have a washing machine, drag it into the plan and place it right here. I think there is enough space for sofa in bedroom, so let's go in symbols again, close appliances, find sofas, find a small sofa for bedroom, click and drag it here, put it on the left, like this and place it right here. Now only thing left is labeling. Double click anywhere on the plan to open a text box. Let's start with living room, like this. Right living room. Double click on the kitchen area, right kitchen. If you want to make the copies, control, click and copy right here. Right utility. We need one for the bathroom and bedroom, like this. Let's edit it, right bedroom and for this, edit it for the bathroom, like this. Now the basic structure is completed including fixtures, furniture and walls. As you saw, we just completed a single bed apartment plan in eDromex using pre-existing library of fixtures and furniture. We can simply drag and drop it into our plan and modify it according to our needs. That's a wrap for today's video. 
Thank you so much for joining us in this video guide of creating floor plan diagrams with Wondershare eDromix. We believe you will find both utility and enjoyment in using this software.